Would you rather test you have ever seen? Are you ready? Well, you better be, because we're about to get started. Would you rather live long and sad or live short and happy? How short? Oh, man. Okay, I'm going to... This is going to be a long video. It's 12 minutes. This is going to be a long video if I pause for all these. So I'm going to... This one I'm going to pause before, though, because I got, like, something on my head already. But the other ones I'm not going to pause. Well, I, I say that I probably will. Though. Okay, you could live long and sad. So let's say you live to 100, but, like, you're sad. <laughs> okay, obviously. I'm just repeating what it says. Or you could live short. What does short mean? So let's say long is 110. Let's say 110. Yeah, let's say 110. That's pretty long. And let's say short. Short, what would short be? I mean, the average is like 78, right? I'm pretty sure that's the average. But what if short is just mean not as long as long? So what if short is like 70? That's 40 years though. Hmm. But it's like you're sad. You're like not enjoying 110 years or 70 years that you're enjoying. Maybe you're like traveling the world. Whereas if you're living it long, you're just sitting here watching TV all day. Just like. But if you're it's lo uh, short and happy, you're traveling, you're having a great time. I'd say, I'd say short and happy. Sorry, that was a lot of yapping. Would you rather get married to a stranger or get married to an ex. Okay, you're not giving me enough time. I might have to make this into two parts because there's six. Okay, we're going to stop at 30, maybe. I think we're going to split this into two videos. Okay, get married to an ex or get married to a stranger. If you get married to a stranger, the stranger could be worse than your ex. If you get married to your ex, that means you you liked them before. But what if you get married to a stranger who you hate is worse than your ex? So I'm going to go with get married to your ex, an ex. Would you rather never eat ice cream again or never eat pizza again? Ice cream or pizza, ice cream or pizza, ice cream or pizza, ice cream or pizza. I feel like I eat more pizza than ice cream. So I'm going to go with never eat ice cream again. Oh, do I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Would you rather be able to speak all languages or be able to communicate with animals? Well, that's tough. Then if you travel the world, you could speak to everybody. But you could speak with cats, dogs. You could speak, you could speak... You could speak with giraffes, tigers? Oh, I'm picking that all day. Be dropped in the middle of the desert or be dropped in the middle of the ocean? I mean, they they both would suck. Dropped in the middle of a desert or the middle of an ocean? What what do you have the better chance of, be, of surviving in? Probably the ocean, right? Because who's going to be like just out about in the middle, the exact middle of the desert? But at least in the ocean, there's the possibility of like a cruise, cruise ship. Do cruise ships go to the middle of the ocean? I don't know. Or like a boat or something, right? Whereas in the desert, what's like... Wait, what was I saying? I don't know. Um. Oh, yeah. I was saying like who's going to... Like is there just going to be some guy riding a camel in the desert? Or, yeah. So let's, let's go with dropped in the... Oh, but in the ocean, you have to swim, though. Whereas if you're on the land, you don't have to, you don't have to swim. You could just stand. But then at least here, it's like, you're not going to be hot because you got like water. Whereas here, you're going to be hot. You, you have no water. You're going to, yeah, I'm going to go with the ocean. But the ocean is scary. I don't know. Ocean. Would you rather be allergic to chocolate or be allergic to smartphones? Oh, how, well, first of all, how would you be allergic to your smartphone? Okay, allergic to chocolate or allergic to smartphone? What do I use more? My phone. I mean, obviously I make videos for a living, but even without the videos, I still, like I don't eat, I won't say I have chocolate that much. And like I could do without it. So I'm gonna go with be allergic to chocolate. Would you rather have the power to heal any illness or have the power to resurrect the dead? Resurrect the dead, easy. Because if you have the power to heal any illness, well, hmm, wait. Yeah, still, I was gonna say, okay, sorry. My thoughts are like here and I'm choosing things based on my thoughts, but I need to explain the thoughts to you guys. Otherwise it'll make no sense. So I was gonna be like, wait, why would you choose? I was gonna be like, why would you choose to heal people when you could just resurrect them? Like, so for example, someone has like a deadly disease. They die from the disease. You could have healed them. So they stayed alive or you just resurrect them from the dead. That's why I was gonna pick resurrect from the dead. But then I was like, wait, if you could heal them, why don't you just heal them? So they never, they never, you never have to resurrect them from the dead. But what if something happens? Like they fall off a cliff, they get hit by a vehicle. You can't fix that because that's not an illness, but you could resurrect them from the dead. So that's why I'm picking resurrect from the dead. Boom. Would you rather find your true love or get your dream job? True love or dream job? True love or dream job? True love or dream job? You know what, guys? I'm going to pick my true love or dream job. I'd pick true love because what if you find your true love and you spend every second of the day with them that you're not at work, which means holidays, weekends. So you just got to survive. It's the way it says dream job. Doesn't even mean like a you have a crappy job. It just says get your dream job. Yeah, true love, true love, true love be a billionaire with no friends and family or be an average person with people who love you. Be an average person with people who love you. I know lots of people will probably say be a billionaire with no friends or family, but here's the thing, guys. You can have all the money in the world, like obviously be a billionaire. It's like you have the money and you buy stuff, but you're not happy, you know? Like he's like, I have this money, but like I have no no one to hang out with, no one to spend the money on. No, what, like what do I do? You know, he's sad. Whereas if you're an average person with people you love, they're not saying like you don't have any money. It's just saying you're an average person with the people you love. So you're spending time every single day with people you love, you're having a good time. I'd rather be happy like that than be sad, right? So that's why I'm choosing the right one. Would you rather always have a slow internet connection or like this video? Is that even a question? Make sure to go drop a like on this video too. Thank you guys. And subscribe while you're at it. Thanks.
Would you rather eat this burger or feed him? Wait, guys. I saw a couple of you guys go down there, but few of you didn't go and slap the like button. I'm going to give you three seconds. One, two, three. Thank you. Okay. Eat this burger or feed him? Well, you're not, you're not giving me much info. Like, what if this guy just got ate? Just got ate? He didn't get ate. He's right there. But what if he just ate some food? Then why would I feed him? If I'm hungry, I'm going to eat the burger. But if this is like a guy, like he's very, he doesn't look that skinny. He just looks like a baby. But if he's like on the street, he doesn't have an owner, then yes, I would give him the burger. But see, we need some backstory. So, you know, I'll, I'll go feed him. I'll would you rather never play video games again or never watch Netflix again? Never play video games again. I honestly, so I used to play lots of video games growing up. But recently, I mean, I played Fortnite. Well, no, because I was in high school when Fortnite came out. I like downloaded Fortnite like the first week it came out and I played that a long, long time. And then when they did us some updates, I played it here in my little setup here. I played it with some friends and stuff. But I'd say I use Netflix a lot more than I play video games now. Recently, the only games I've been playing is for my gaming channel. And I tend to watch Netflix. Like I tend to sit down for at least like an hour. Well, no, not every night. But like, I like to sit down and relax before going to bed. So I usually watch ne like Netflix or YouTube. So I'm going to go with never play video games again. I know lots of you guys will disagree with me on that one. Okay, we've only done like 12. Date of your death or know how you're going to oh, die. Oh, neither. Wait, the date of your death. So you could, or how you're going to die. The date of your death or how you can die. Okay, if you know the date of your death, like what if it's like in a week? Or what if it's in like 70 years? But if you know how you're gonna die, you could try and prevent it, right? Like what if it's like you get hit by a bus? Then it's like, just don't don't walk on the street. So I'm gonna go with know how you're gonna die because then you could try and prevent it. Look young and feel like an old person or look old and feel like a young person. Look old and feel like a young person. I'd rather look guys or people think, or ah! Guess what you look like guys. If you're like young, but you're like, oh, I can barely get out of this chair. I'd rather be an old guy. Or it's not even saying it old, it just says you look old. And be able to go, woohoo, lippity hoo, oh, I'm gonna climb this ladder, doo -doo -doo, you know? Rather give up social media or give up on your favorite food for the rest of your life. Well, my job is social media, so I'm gonna say give up on my favorite food. Would you rather lose the one you love the most or lose all of your memories. Okay, that's a tough one. Lose the one you love the most, you'd be sad forever, or lose all your memories, and then it's like you wouldn't even know who your loved one is, the person you love the most because you don't have any memories. But I'm still gonna pick lose all your memories because you can make more memories with that person. Wise words. Would you rather be rich and ugly or be poor and gorgeous? Rich and ugly, I guess. It's all about what's in here, guys. Who cares about the looks? Have a pause button in your life or have a rewind button in your life. Easy, rewind. Pause, you pause to think about stuff. You can never go back though. Rewind, instead of pausing, just rewind, easy. Would you rather lose the ability to read or lose the ability to speak? The ability to read or ability to speak. Probably the ability to speak. Or I mean, the ability to read, sorry. It didn't say the ability to see, it just said to read. So you can still see stuff, you just can't read stuff. But if you can't speak, you can't speak. So I'm gonna say ability to read. Would you rather save 100 kittens or save 50 puppies? What kind of question is this? 100 kittens or 50 puppies? I've had cats my whole life. I've never had dogs, although my mom's wanted dogs. But it's just, we've had the cats. And the dogs and the cats don't always go together, you know? But then also dogs are more work because you gotta like walk them every day and though that. Or cats, like, they're not as much work. You could like leave them for a day and they'll be fine and stuff. But I'm, I could save 50 more kittens. I'm gonna say kittens then. I'm saving 50 more. If it said 100 puppies and 50 kittens, I'd say 100 puppies because I'm saving 50 more. I'm gonna say kittens. I know you guys are probably like, but Luke, dogs are smart, cats are stupid, but it's still 50 more. Would you rather become a billionaire or live twice as long? Okay, again, this is very vague. Because, like, becoming a billionaire, okay, you're becoming a billionaire. But living twice as long, does that mean, like, let's just say you could live to 200. So does that mean I'm going to be healthy all 200 years? Or does that mean, like, once I'm 80, I'm going to be, like, not healthy and not be able to do stuff for the rest of my life? I'm going to go with that you'd be healthy for living twice as long. And they're not saying you're poor. They're just saying you're not a billionaire. I'm going to say twice as long. Because, guys, here's a good here's a good quote. Or not a, it's not a quote. I just saw this video a long, a long time ago, and I always remember it every once in a while. But it was a guy interviewing someone. I guess it is kind of a quote. But it is. The question is, guys, I'll give you one million million dollars but you won't wake up the next morning would you take it no because you won't wake up you won't be able to use the million dollars so your life is more worth more than a million dollars but it's the same thing with a billion i'll give you a billion dollars but you won't wake up the next morning obviously you're not gonna take it well, i mean maybe some of you guys will just give it to your family or something but like i mean that that's a decent option but like most of you will be like no because you won't wake up in the morning so your life is worth more than a billion dollars so live twice as long boom, 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 boom. not sleep for five days or not eat for 10 days not sleep for five days not eat for 10 days i hate sleeping wait but is it like you're gonna you're gonna be tired or you just can't sleep i feel like they're gonna 
they say you're gonna be tired, but this one you're gonna be starving. People have done like fasts before, like it's you know fasting, you know. But I'm gonna say sleep because I hate sleeping. Like well, in the morning I like to sleep, but like I hate going to bed. This is my like top ten things. This right there number one. Maybe not actually, but like I just I hate sleeping. I hate the the whole process. Of, like okay, time to get ready for bed. Brush my teeth, wash my face, do all this, go into bed, just lay there until I magically fall asleep. I just hate that process. I wish I could just like like be sitting on the couch. I mean I could do this, but it's just this like no, you don't you don't want to do this. Just lay on the couch watching TV, watching Netflix, and then oh, and then wake up and then start my day. I wish I could do that, but like I just hate the whole process. Okay, sorry, <laughs> that was that was a long rant. Video of this choice was really hard for you. Oh, I'm unliking it now. Don't actually keep keep the like on my video, please. Do you okay. rather drop a wait phone? wait a second? Did I already react to this video on my other channel? No, I don't think so. I just used to set a, th a thumbnail, I think, because these questions I don't remember them, or do I? I don't know. No, I, I don't remember. So we'll keep it. Drop a puppy dog. Okay, obviously I'm gonna drop a phone. I'm not dropping a dog. Who do you think I am? Would you rather eat only candy or eat only junk food? Only candy or only junk food. Only candy or only junk food. Honestly, only junk food. Because candy, after a while, you know, if you drink, you have too many like sweets or chocolates, you just don't feel good, you know? I mean, I guess same thing with junk food. Like junk food, like, oh, I don't know. It just looks better to be like, oh, greasy fries. I'm only eating greasy fries and burgers, pizza, chips. Whereas candy is like candy. You're going to get like, you can have no teeth by the end of the year. Would you rather walk across glowing coals? or walk across broken glass. Ah, uh, I think broken glass. It's like walking across glowing coals, you most likely burn your feet. You can have like permanent burns to your feet and then you, it will like suck to walk for the rest of your life. Whereas walking on broken glass, you most likely get a few cuts, but like if you like go walk like you're walking on feathers or walking on feathers, walk like you are you are a feather, sorry. And like trying to maneuver where there's not as much sharp stuff. You could probably make it out with just a couple like little nicks, you know? Have $1 million right now or have $1,000 every week for the rest of your life. Where's my calculator? Let's say how many years am I gonna live? I'm gonna live till I'm 100. Actually, no, I'm gonna live till I'm 110, okay? 120, make it. I'll live until I'm 120. Mark my words. Okay, um, uh, how old are they now? 20, 21 and four days, though. So let's say, oh, what's the math on this? 79? 79 more years. Oh, no, 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 that's till 100. 91 more years. Oof, I got a long time. Okay, 91. Wait, how do I even do the math? $1,000 every week for the rest of your life. Okay, 91. How many weeks are there in a year? 52.18. Okay, what's well, 52.18 times 91? Or no, 91. No, it's not 91. It's 90, 99. 99, yeah, what am I? What's well, 52.18 times 99? 5,100. 165.82. Okay, now what's what's 5,165.28 times 1,000? Five million dollars. Wait, I thought it was gonna be way more. Yeah, five mil. You can live on a thousand. Yeah, five million. Let's do that one. Sorry, that was a lot of weird calculations. Would you rather never brush your teeth again or never wash your hair again? Never brush my teeth again. Okay, well, again, is it like you'll never brush your teeth again, but your teeth will stay healthy? Because if that's the case, I'm taking never brush my teeth again. Because that's one of the most that's one of the things I hate the most about getting ready for bed. That whole process is oh, gotta brush my teeth. By the time I brush my teeth, I'm wide awake again if I was tired. I'm gonna never brush teeth again. Would you rather have no one at your wedding or have no one at your funeral? Probably no one at my funeral. Or no, 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 sorry. No one at my wedding. Because at least I've got my wife, you know? But if no one's at your funeral, then it's like, man, nobody cared about you. But if no one was at your wedding, that means nobody cares about you then. I'm still gonna go with no one at my wedding. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, I'm gonna be gone, so I can't even tell if people are at my funeral or not. So maybe no one at my funeral then. And then I could spend my wedding with a whole bunch of friends and family. There you go. No one, no one at my funeral. Would you rather live without water? or live without electricity. Are we talking drinking water or just regular water? Live without electricity, live without water. I'm gonna say electricity. Ooh, but then you don't have TV or anything. But if you're living without water, you can't wash your hands, can't flush the toilet, can't shower. But if you're living without electricity, you can't turn on the lights. Yeah, this is a tough one, man. And I'm very lucky that I have both of these because there's some people who don't have either. The people who don't have water, some people who don't have electricity. So I'm very lucky. I'm not even gonna answer this one. This one's, I don't know, I gotta answer. Um, I'm gonna say without electricity. Or wait, I'm gonna say, no, I'm gonna say without water. No, I'm saying without water because maybe there's like a tap down the street that I could get some water from. Then I have electricity. Then I could use that water with my electricity to cook food. There. Would you rather lose a leg or lose a hand? Okay, this is the last question. Lose a leg or lose a hand? Okay, so what do I like doing right now? Like, what's what's uh like what what activities do I like to do? Snowboard. Snowboarding is using your legs. I like to golf. Golf uses your legs and your hands, but you can't really. You need both your hands to golf. Hmm. This is a tough one. I'm gonna leave this one up to you guys. Cause again, I'm very fortunate that I have all my stuff. You know, I feel like this is a bad question. Should be. I should be choosing one. I should be just grateful. So I'm gonna let you guys choose in the comments down below. And I'll split this up into a second video because this is already a long video. I think that's good for today's video. If you guys enjoyed my. <laughs> That's gonna be it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to slap the like button, subscribe if you're not already, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.